Hey team, welcome back to HD Designs Crochet HDDC. I'm Heather and this is my channel where we are going to talk all about the granny square and crochet design, motherhood and a few things in between. So if you are brand new, hi, hello and welcome. Thank you so much for giving my channel a chance. And if you're returning, what's good, what's happening? I hope that you are all tickety boo. Now, grab yourself a project and sit down for a few minutes while we have a chat about a brand new design. I have got two samples of the same design to show to you today. We'll start with the pink, shall we? Yeah. Oh, upside down. This blanket is called Love Struck. I designed this blanket when I had had my son. He was about two or three weeks old and I was just so, so hugely in love with him. Obviously, I still am. And I wanted to crochet, I wanted to be making something and I wanted to make it for him. So from there came the idea of making him a heart-shaped blanket and I originally made his in orange because throughout my pregnancy I absolutely craved oranges, orange, e orange anything. As long as it was orange flavoured and possibly fizzy, I wanted it. And so I picked out all the shades that I had to make Teddy's blanket. Um, the colours that I have used are a mix of high street brands. The pattern calls for double knit yarn and I use acrylic yarn. You can use any fibre content that you want. I've had testers use cotton and all different blends. It's entirely up to you. And then the background colour is this cream and it's from the pound shop in the United Kingdom. Again, all double knit yarn. And then the pattern has a... It's got my signature HDDC border and it uses, it brings together all of the colours within the, within the heart into the border. And I have just released this pattern so you can now get yourself a copy, it's linked below. It is a super quick make, like it's so so fun to make. It's perfect. If you know of any babies that are due anytime soon, it's like the perfect gift for them. Um, I haven't seen... Everyone loves handmade for a baby and especially because it has the heart in it. And the colour possibilities are truly endless. I'm going to put a slideshow up to show you the blankets that my testers have made and all of the different colours that they have gone for because it gives you so much inspiration seeing them and you can also search for all of these using the hashtag crocheting lovestruck and I will try my best to put all of their Instagram accounts here and below for you as well. This pattern already has a bunch of reviews on my website so I'm going to read out one of my favourite ones for you. I mean they're all my favourite but I'm going to read one out for you right now. It's from Courtney, she's given me five stars, thank you so so much, and she's put love 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 the love struck pattern. It's such a versatile pattern allowing you to make endless possibilities of colour combos, a handy guide to help you plan your colour square also. The pattern was so easy to follow along and so fun to make. Granny Squares, Granny Stripe is so therapeutic to crochet. I loved every minute of it. Great for stash busting as you can use up so many different colours within this pattern too. Would a thousand percent recommend. Thank you. Thank you. 
This pattern is available on my Shopify website. It's also available on Etsy and Ravelry. And at some point I will be putting it on Love Crafts as well. I think my favourite thing about this pattern, other than it being hearts, granny square, amazing and fun and quick to make, is hearing the stories of who the blankets are being gifted to. Like somebody has a sister that's expecting their second baby or there is a grandmother that's expecting a new grandchild or multiple grandchildren. There's somebody who's made it for a work colleague. Like it's the stories. I love knowing that there's going to be a whole entire generation of Teddy's age and beyond that are going to be wrapped up in love every single night in their own love struck blanket. How adorable is that? So that's my love struck blanket. A few of the details for you in case you want to know details. The skill level is beginner. As long as you know how to crochet, then you can learn how to make this blanket. I have a granny square guide that you will also get for free when you download my granny square patterns. And it teaches you how to make the standard HGDC granny square. Um, everything is in there. Color selection, how to weave in your ends like it's all in there. If you can hold a crochet hook or you want to learn how to hold a crochet hook, you can make this blanket. As I said, it uses double knit yarn. I have used about 350 grams of yarn in total, so you could totally stash bust. You need about 140 grams for the heart. Dive into that stash. Dive into that stash. The pattern has got US and UK terms within the one document. It's actually UK terms first and then US. So no matter which ones you are versed in, it's both there for you. Um, there's also a blank chart. I'll show you it on screen. So you can colour in the heart and play around with your colour combinations. Um, there's also continuous join as you go chart. So um, I actually joined all of the backing squares this cream using the continuous join as you go method and I have a chart on there for left and right handers so you can do the same and you'll always get the lifetime updates for free and there's a discount code in there for your next project as well so I mean I think that's a pretty good bargain so that's my love struck pattern and I'll see you again soon Comment below with your favourite colour scheme or what colour you would make yours in and I'll see you later.